Hi, my name is Carrie Edgren. I am the associate pastor here at Terrace Lake. My wife, Kate, and I have two daughters, Charlotte and Jane, and we've been a part of this church since 2009. A couple of the areas I serve in are student ministries as well as with the community groups. Today, I want to share a little bit about our community groups ministry. Community groups are made up of men and women, plus a ton of kids who desire to grow in their relationship with Christ in the context of a fellowship of believers. We are committed to meeting on a regular basis, praying for one another, sharing life with each other, and getting into the Word of God. We desire to live out the vision of the church working as one body with Christ as our head beyond Sunday morning, providing support, training, and discipleship for those who are seeking to glorify God with their lives. Most community groups meet twice a month, either here at the church or in a home. Most follow the sermon series, yet will take breaks to focus on a topic which the leader and group decide. Community groups, however, are more than just a bi-weekly meeting or Bible study. These are groups of men and women, groups of families coming together as one family to learn, celebrate, worship, cry, support, and truly know one another as they seek to know Christ more. Jeff Jewett has been leading a community group for a while now, and he's recently gone through the dialogue study as a group. So he's going to share a little bit about that. Christ followers have experienced the good news and can explain it in a variety of ways using scripture. But how do we move from a typical conversation with an unbeliever to one that begins to introduce the gospel? In January, our community group began a journey together to find out the answer to this question. And as we studied dialogue, it was our desire to grow spiritually by seeking to fulfill our mission to go and make disciples. Our group was energized by this study and immediately began praying for opportunities to move everyday conversations with coworkers, neighbors, and family to a spiritual level. And we loved sharing these stories with each other. One of the most impactful stories involves Jake, one of the guys who has several Chinese coworkers, both in the US and China. In order to better communicate with them, Jake began taking Chinese lessons. As he was talking with his coworker in China, they decided that they could help each other learn their languages. Jake would help Li Chung with English, and Li Chung would help Jake with Chinese. All of this done over the phone, thousands of miles apart. As they began, they had to pick a topic. So Jake asked Li Chung, what do you want to learn about? And Li Chung answered, tell me about Jesus. God clearly opened this door and Jake used this opportunity to present the gospel. Their relationship continues to deepen and we pray and look forward to more opportunities for Jake and Li Chung to talk about Jesus. This also fits perfectly with what our entire church has been learning through the Christ and Culture series of how we are to engage the culture. Community groups are a great way to get connected at Terrace Lake, to create new relationships and to grow in your faith. Fill out a connect form or visit the connect desk on a Sunday morning to find out more.